Hi guys, welcome to another episode. In this video, I want to talk about uh, some animated splash screen, and you can see it in this video. Uh, and I try to uh, make it uh, easy with custom paint, and uh, we can do it very simple. Let's go. Okay, you can see in my build method in splash page, I have a simple new game text and, and, a, and a custom paint. And all these animations things are happening in my custom paint. And let's check what happened in custom painter. Uh, and you can do it by widgets. For example, you can generate 40 items because these circles are 40 items. You can add it positioned with for example, you can pass a list of positioned widgets, but it's not good for performance, but you can do it. Uh, and you need to create 40 widgets, but with custom paint, we can uh, ready, uh, we can uh, very, very, we do it with very performant way. And uh, in a splash painter, in constructor, I generate two list of offsets and these offsets are positioned in the screen. For example, in here, 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 and everywhere. They are randomly generated in here. And why I I use I consider two list because I want to have two po two position for each circle to have animation from here and here, for example. I have two random position and I want to change my position from two points. And they are randomly generated. And for handle uh, uh, animation, I pass my animation to a splash painter. It, it's our best practice because a splash painter have a repaint that's listenable in constructor and uh, you don't need to set a state or change a state or rebuild your painter it's not good for performance you can do it with a listenable item called a repaint and you can pass animation or modification listener and a custom painter can handle this for you and every time your animation is changed the this paint method is redraw and re uh, repaint all this code and you can see I uh, only pass my uh, animation uh, to that and one image for these Bitcoin icons. I explain you. And uh, okay, let's go. For drawing these circles, I consider a bit focus in here. I create a path for every time we are drawing this and add oval for circle i use oval and with this method direct that from circle we need to pass a center and radius with this two line i am calculating offsets every time my animation is changed for example if i have a point in here and a point in here i am calculate and uh, smoothly with animation change i change my position to here and reverse and i check for example uh, uh, every five item uh, repassed i add uh, my image with draw image method and i uh, you can see i passed my image uh, that's by uh, by data i have it in here i uh, use my assets and uh, add it to a uh, byte data because in custom binary you can't use image dot assets. You need to add uh, byte data, and I uh, uh, and I am converting my image. And uh, in custom painter, we need uh, an UI image, not image. You can see I use UI because in here I have Dart UI as a UI and not my material image. And uh, everything goes fine, I think. Uh, 
and for uh, changing my size you can see some some of them is small some of them is big i use if uh, my index is even i use 10 for radius and otherwise i use 7 to small to have it a small and uh, after that i passed the color of my paint and draw path okay let's check for animation i used animation controller twin double and animation double and if you want to use animation controller you need to add this mix scenes single uh, take a provider set mix scene and add a duration for example in 10 seconds these uh, animation and these movements are happened i use uh, a twin to do my animation from 10 to 1 and I have a curved animation because I want to uh, add uh, some smoothness you can change your uh, curve to other things it's it's related to you and I called animate and pass it to animation and these animation have a value that we called uh, animation is listenable and pass it to a splash painter and everything is happened in here and yeah that's it and you have some very beautiful animation and i i wish you like it uh, thank you for joining and uh, goodbye